What a fantastic view from here it is. This is Oxford Circus, and that's Regent Street with its Christmas lights. I wonder, what's the best view to capture these in a time lapse? I just showed you the time lapses, didn't I? Yes, it's up there. This place has been an absolute bucket list viewpoint of mine because it's just a beautiful view of the Oxford Circus, people crossing and all the traffic, as well as now at Christmas lights towards all the Christmas lights. And I've been invited by Regent Street Destination to come and shoot from their amazing rooftop. So that's what we're doing today. So we're just heading up to Seven Swallow Place, to the rooftop at Seven Swallow Place, which has that beautiful view. Let's go outside. Ooh, that's a cool rooftop, this. This is a pretty decent view. Definitely gonna set up one time-lapse view here. Setup is the 12 mil on the Z6, shooting actually pointing down because lines will be screwed and I never ever do that, but for this occasion, well that's the angle that you have to do because I was supposed to shoot it straight, then I would not capture everything that's happening down there. Hence, I am tilting down, which is cringing even in my heart to not have the line straight, but sometimes you have to do what you have to do. And here's that first time lapse that I've captured from this absolutely epic bucket list viewpoint of London. Right, so despite absolutely freezing hands, I've managed to set up the slide pod and it's sliding through this gap in the railing and then this is a nice feature of the building that I thought would add to the reveal of the 12 mil shooting and sliding above that thing. So I think that time lapse will look pretty cool. Decided to go with one second interval and um, yeah, shooting 0.6 of a second shutter just to capture it as fast as I can because in five minutes I've got last shot that I want to do over Regent Street in the last 15 minutes that we've got here because we've only had here one hour. I've actually managed to pull it off, finished that shoot, packed it, and got here for one quick last time lapse of uh, Regent Street. Shooting obviously with the 105 low light beast. I can shoot an ISO 50, 0 0.6 second shutter. Maybe for this actually a longer one would work slightly better, but being constrained on time, I'd rather shoot more frames and speed it up if I need to then shoot 1.6 second exposures because that's the shutter setting in a two second interval that I think would work better. But what a fantastic view from here it is. And now the best time lapse saved for last. The beautiful view directly over Regent Street towards Piccadilly Circus, over all the angel lights that are just so familiar with Regent Street and London by now. Hope you enjoyed this time lapse and this video, and I will leave you with a couple of time lapses that I shot just after leaving that beautiful rooftop, which I do hope I will be back one day to maybe shoot some stuff during daytime because I would absolutely love to do that. Thanks for watching, see you in the next video.